These are the type of people, you know, whenever Nick takes little shots at me, he can't help but make me sound like a nerd because I have glasses or whatever, as if I don't have like two inches on him and like 40 pounds on him. But these fucking people, dude, like the average guy who watches my videos is like a mid 20s guy who works out and probably has a girlfriend. The average groiper is like unironically a 15 year old autistic incel. That's just the reality of the situation. And then they call me when I'm doing a live stream. Hey, hey, John, um, why didn't you speak in AFPAC? <laughs> hey, John, like, they're actually autistic. <sighs> like, we, we joke about having autism because it's funny, but, like, these people are, like, literally autists. And that's why they're so fixated on this whole, like, oh, we're going to, we're gonna like, take power. And we're going to, like, take power. It's like, no, you, you think that these ideas are new because you're 15 years old and your entire concept of politics is like three years old. Not even actually, probably less than two years old. So you're not old enough to understand like what happened in 2016. You're not old enough to understand what was happening in the 1990s um, just because your political education is so young. Uh, so yeah, like you're retarded and autistic. So yeah, we're counter signaling. We are counter signaling. Anyways. Um, Nick likes you and a lot of people follow both of you. Yeah, it's true. There's overlap, but there exists a hierarchy where he thinks that he can like take shots at me and what I do. And, and like, that's not going to be reciprocated, uh, which is like retarded because I've been nothing but nice to him. I've like literally used resources of mine to help him. And then he'll do reactions to my streams and like make fun of me. And it's just like, do his little impressions, you know, make me sound like a nerdy, like, dude, again, I have 40 pounds on you. Like, you're an incel, you counter signal working out, uh, and you're supposed to be the voice for, like, young men. Like, you're telling young men that, like, it's okay to be an incel and not get married. And you, you're cl claiming you're an advocate of, like, saving the white race when the only girl that you've ever expressed an interest in uh, was a girl who talks about pegging her boyfriend and you thought this was, like, funny. Sorry. We're going off. We have to go off. You know, you push me into a corner. You push me into a corner. <laughs>